Hey, what's up, you guys? It's Sunny Avi, and I am going to do little daily card pulls for you all. I got some time, so let's say I'm going to do it for January 3rd, 4th, and 5th. Happy birthday to my Capricorns out there. Hopefully, your birthday will be great. All right, so keep in mind that these are generals and things that I talk about when I resonate with you, which will be all right. Disclaimer with my readings I do talk fast, I do curse. And due to me reading for a lot of different energies, my readings can be pretty jumpy. Okay, so January 3rd. What's going on for... Um, did I say this? Um, if you like a personal reading, please go to www.thesunnyclothes.com. That link and other information is in the description bar below. Goodness, I ain't even say that shit. Alright, let's see. January 3rd. What's going on? Everyone all over the world, people that need to hear the message. I'm hearing I beg to differ. All right, so we have the six of pentacles in reverse. I feel that some of you, you may have a hard time getting along with people having, um, having a sane conversation, having an agreeable conversation, having a, um, a pleasant connection. Maybe you will vibe with some people, but I feel like there's something off. Maybe for some of you, like, you feel like something isn't right. You're a bit worried about something. Uh, for others of you, there may be an issue in regards to your financial situation. Maybe you lose money. Maybe um, an unexpected bill comes. Um, maybe there's going to be some issues with the law. Okay. Uh, maybe you're... You're in a situation where someone owes you money. Like, there isn't an even exchange. Maybe you feel like uh, you're paying all the bills and your spouse or whoever lives with you, like, they don't do anything, vice versa, okay? Um, I, I keep picking up this energy of, like, feeling like you're doing it all alone. Or maybe you're reminiscing during this time where, you know, you were doing everything all on your own. Uh, and it makes you sad. You know, maybe you're thinking about all the times where people didn't understand you, people didn't get you. So many of you, like, you may kind of be in your feelings right now. Or once again, you just may feel a bit of bad luck when it comes to money, when it comes to the law, okay? Um, I am picking up that some of you, there may be some issues with health as well going on. Especially in regards to the legs and the feet. Yep. Not a good time to sign contracts. Not a good time to get loans. Um, you can ask for money. You can borrow money. Not really a good time to do that because you may not pay it back. Um, or if someone asks you to borrow money, you may not see that money. And it's just going to be a big mess with that. Yes, yes, a big mess with that. Uh, not a good time to start relationships. Uh, or to propose, to be honest, because um, it may not end well. It may not end well. For others of you, I feel like it may be a good time to work on relationships. It's going to be uh, kind of weird, um, meaning you may have to kind of fuss and fight and once again go through disagreements in order for you and that person to bring in harmony. Uh, for some of you, you may find out that your partner is cheating today. Okay. Let's see what's going on on the 4th. Oh, a lot of cards hopping out. Some of y'all wanted to know about your partner. <laughs> yes, yeah, some of y'all definitely wanted to know about that. If you do, just go to my website and get a personal read, and I don't mind answering that. All right, so January 4th, everyone all over the world, whoever these messages resonate with, what's going on for January 4th, 2020? All right, so we have the Five of Cups. Um... Some of you, you need to be cautious of you feeling trapped, um, of you being too vulnerable during this time. On another note, I am picking up where some of you, you're trying to bounce back. 
uh, from heartache, from loss. You're trying to uh, make yourself feel good during this time. Please be careful of you um, trying to fill in voids as in you're, you're shopping to to heal yourself, you're overeating, you're smoking, you're drinking. Uh, for some reason, I feel like this is going to be the time where, uh, once again, filling in your voids uh, and triggers are going to pop up. So, you know, you may be in a situation where someone talks about something or brings up something and it, it just, it just makes you sad. Okay. Um, I am picking up uh, that some of you, uh, you may feel as if someone is stealing something from you. Um, you may find out that someone is, you know, literally stealing something from you. Um, but I just feel like some of you, you may not get your way during this time. There's going to be, once again, issues with lost. Um, but I feel like this is on the emotional plane. Um, possibly spiritual, but there's this energy of either feeling lost, losing something, um, being like having a loss of words. Okay. Um, but I feel like this is going to be a good time to try to get out of it. Yes. Acknowledge those feelings of loss, um, of being lost, excuse me, acknowledge those feelings of being lost. And, um, understand where it's coming from in order for you to fully heal okay um some of you uh there may be issues with rain or gray skies during this time rather this is literally um or once again like your atmosphere is just a bit gray all right so what's going on for the 5th of january for people all over the world or whoever this message uh, can relate to. What's going on for the 5th of January? Alright, so we have the 3 of Cups. Okay, so some of you, you may be having a lot of sex <laughs> on this day. Um, this may be a fertile time for some of you. Okay, um, this is kind of cool. If you are familiar with the Rider Rate 5 of Cups card, there's three cups knocked over, but with the three of cups, there's obviously three cups, and they're uplifted. So, some of you, you may get what you want during this time, okay? Something that's been causing you a lot of emotional stress and, and emotional pain. You may be getting your wishes during this time, but once again, on the 4th, you are going to have to, once again, acknowledge why you're hurting, acknowledge where the shit's coming from in order for you to get what you want the next day, okay? So, I feel like the 4th, is a test okay it is a test and it's trying to see if you're strong enough to get what you want if you're in the mindset to get what you want okay so definitely change your mindset if you really want some shit okay also um the fifth may be a good day for spell work it really depends um especially if you are doing like water spells um, spells uh, tying into the water element definitely do that spiritual baths um, the cup ritual um, wishing wells um, lakes streams ponds oceans anything involving water do that it may manifest great for you um, just be mindful of the moon cycle is what I'm picking up on um, whatever sign the moon is, look at the, look at, the, look for that particular sign in your natal chart and see what house that sign is in, what, what planet that sign is in, whatever the case may be, um, to see if it's going to work in your favor. Okay. Um, I am picking up that some of you, you may be meeting new friends during this time. You may be catching up with old friends. I feel like there's going to, um, for some of you, be a little bit cautious for a misunderstanding as well. But I feel like 90%, 9 times out of 10, um, I feel like the 5th is going to be a, a brighter day, more uplifted. Um, for some of you, I definitely see you getting your way. Once again, I see your wish being granted. Uh, once again, like there's this for, for there's this um, fertility 
energy. So if you want to have a baby, have sex on the 5th. Um, make sure this person aligns with you and your future. Um, I am picking up on a well-needed conversation. So maybe um, there's a conversation that you need to have with someone. It's going to be great to have that on the 5th rather than the 4th. Okay. Um, yeah, I, I just see the 5th being much better for majority of you. Okay. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this. I'm going to do these more often. Good luck with your thing and I shall see you next video. Take care. Bye.